Hello everyone, my name is Grace and today I am going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is 28th chapter, Naaman met God. Chapter 2, Kings 5. Naaman was a great army commander in Syria. He was a brave soldier, but he had a trouble skin disease called leprosy. Naaman, Naaman's Israel servant girl said, Go see the prophet Elisha in the Israel. He can heal you. Naaman took many gifts with him. He took the king's letter to the King of Israel. He reached Elisha's home by his chariot. Elisha sent a serv servant out, a man with a message. Wash yourself seven times in the Jordan. You will be healed. Naaman, at first time, Naaman was mad at Elisha. He thought it was a silly thing to do. <clears throat> Elisha doesn't even come out and to see me. Elisha does, doesn't even come out to see me. He doesn't pr even pray for me. In the name of the God, he doesn't even touch me. Jordan River is not only the river. Naaman was mad and tried to go back home. On his way home, his servant told him, Please go to the Jordan. This is not a hard thing to do. You just wash yourself. Naaman went to the Jordan, as Elisha said. He Washed him seven times. Naaman's skin became like a clean that of a child. His skin disease was gone. Naaman was very happy. Naaman came back to Elisha. To, he tried to give Elisha gifts. Elisha didn't. A, a the gifts, Elisha told him to serve God. Naaman was healed and he did what Elisha said. Elisha told him about God. 29th chapter, Joshua repaired the temple. Chapter 2, Jerusalem 24. King Joshua by a sir Josh left God. He did what God pleased. He won wanted his people to do what God pleased. He wanted his people come to his God's temple often. God's temple was not good in shape. People didn't take care good care of the temple. I have to repair the house of God. King Joshua made up his mind to repair it. I need money to do it. Make a big box to collect offerings and put that put it outside the temple. King Joshua commanded. People people were happy to help repair the temple.
They brought offerings. When the box was full, King's servant took the offerings out and put the box back. King Joshua collected lots of money to repair the temple. King Josh gave the money to the worker workers. He here my sons and carpen carpenters. He heard what work workers for metal work. They ruled very hard. They repaired the temple very well. They rebuilt the temple of God according to his original design. They made things of God's temple with the rest of the money. The temple became to became a worship place. The temple became a happy place. 30 chapter B. Building a new wall. Nehemiah chapter 1 to 8. Nehemiah was a servant of Persia's king. One day, Nehemiah heard some sad news at the palace. The wall of Jerusalem was broken down. The gates of Jerusalem were burned. Nyamia cried several days. He prayed with eat, without eating anything. The king asked Nyamia, What? Why are you so sad? Nyamia answered, The temple of God is God in my country is ruined. The gates of the city burned with fire. King liked Nyamia. The king was worried. Ask he asked Nyamia, what do you want? me to do for you? Nyamia answered, send me home. Please allow to rebuild the wall. You may go. Rebuild the wall. I will give you whatever you want, said the king. The king gave Nyamia blocks to build the wall. He took the blocks to return home. Blocks and returned home. Nyamia met helpers. They began to rebuild the wall. Some people didn't want to rebuild the wall. Sanballat and Tobia were were very angry at that idea. They laughed at the people of Israel. They tried to hurt Nehemiah. They tried to hurt the helpers of Nehemiah. They didn't want to rebuild the wall. God helped Nehemiah to build the wall. God helped Nehemiah to put up the gates of the city. Nehemiah did what God wanted to do. It was a, not easy to rebuild a wall. They rebuilt the wall with God's help. The friends of Nehemiah came to see the wall. They thanked God for helping. Nehemiah, they thank God for making Nehemiah rebuild the wall. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy? And next time I will read another story.
And next time I will read 31 chapter, The Brave Queen Esther. Then see you next time. Bye!